हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू ज्योमेट्री स्कूल स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आई विल गेट यू द करंट अफेयर ऑफ द मंथ जुलाई एंड दिस इज पार्ट फोर पार्ट वन टू थ्री आई हैव ऑलरेडी अपलोडेड सो दो स्टूडेंट्स हु डिड नॉट सी द पार्ट वन टू एंड थ्री प्लीज गो डू वॉच द पार्ट वन टू थ्री एंड दिस इज पार्ट फोर एंड द मीडियम ऑफ द लैंग्वेज विल बी इंग्लिश फॉर विच एग्जाम दिस वीडियो विल बी हेल्पफुल दिस वीडियो विल बी हेल्पफुल फॉर आर आई एम सी एग्जाम फॉर विच द एग्जाम डेट हैज बीन फाइनलाइज What is the final exam date for the December RIMC? That is third December. Third December is the uh, deadline. Uh, is the exam date? So in the RIMC, the weightage of current affair is very good. Around twenty questions. Around twenty questions comes from this section, current affair. And RMS exam, the weightage is good. Ten questions come from this section. And Sanic School, five to six question come from this section. Out of twenty five question, and five to six question are very important. Not not uh, too much less weightage okay so uh, if you want to crack these exams you have to be strong in current affairs uh, okay and up sanic school this is there so the weightage of current affair also there you can uh, gain benefit from this current affair in the up sanic school exam also so uh, if you want to join like class how can you join just rimc rms up sanic jnvst all india sanic school entrance examination Uh, for the the live classes of these entrance exam, you can dial on these numbers. These are our official number. Just call these numbers. Our expert will provide you the proper information how to join the live classes and how to get the access of live classes. And two live classes are free of cost. You you don't have to pay any charge for the two live classes. Two live classes are free of cost. And later you have to pay the charge if you continue. The charges are accordingly. If you want to join crash course, if you want to take mock test, recorded lectures, whatever you want, and the 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 product you uh, need, uh, actually uh, the material you need to improve your uh, preparation. If you want to crack these exams, so you have to take um, one of these products. And live class is the best. I suggest you live class best because live class you can ask your live doubt also. So. Uh, we had launched uh, Prambir batch for Sanic School from fifteen uh, July, so still you can join in this batch. Uh, the syllabus is not covered too much, so uh, still there is a possibility that you can join this batch. How can you join? Just dial this number. Uh, and uh, this is our uh, Telegram group. How can you join? To scan through QR code. Just scan this QR code and join the Telegram group. These are our recorded courses. You can avail these courses. These are our recorded courses as well as test series, mock test papers. You can avail these in the series and most mock test paper. So today is part four. Today is part four, and the month is July. This is the last part. In each part, as you know, I cover twenty five questions. Or oh, and in a whole month, I teach. I cover four part. So total question will be four into twenty five. That is hundred question. So I cover hundred question in a whole month. So the number of question is very less. number of question is very less but the possibility of these questions to come in the exam is very high is very high you can trust i had already uploaded a video about how many questions came from our videos so you will notice that around 44 questions in the last rimc exam that held in uh, june 2022 around 44 question directly came from our various series current affairs series mahayag series sankalp series so this time i assure you around 50 question will come from these our uh, series directly will come from these series okay last time i gave you a burning question what was the burning question as you know at the end of each video i give you a burning question what was the burning question burning question was where is the headquarter of ed because nowadays ed is in a very high action every in the every newspaper in the every news channel you will see ed raid over there ed raid at that place ed raid to the leader that leader so ed is in very new it is a, uh, at every newspaper you will watch the ed ed in action okay so where is the headquarter of ed ed headquarter is in new delhi the correct answer is new delhi and the, what is the full form of ed directorate of enforcement directorate of enforcement okay directorate of enforcement enforcement director d i R E C T O R A T Directorate of Enforcement. Okay, next question. So today's question number one. Twenty third July is observed as so twenty third July is observed as National Broadcasting Day. National Broadcasting Day and why? Why? 
बिकॉज द फर्स्ट रेडियो ब्रॉडकास्ट इन इंडिया फ्रॉम द बॉम्बे स्टेशन ओके अकर्ड ऑन दिस डे ओके इन नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी सेवन इन ट्वेंटी थर्ड जुलाई नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी सेवन फर्स्ट रेडियो ब्रॉडकास्ट हैपन फ्रॉम बॉम्बे स्टेशन ओके सो दैट्स वाई ट्वेंटी थर्ड जुलाई इज ऑब्जर्व नेशनल ब्रॉडकास्टिंग डे वट इज नेशनल टीचर्स डे इट इज फाइव सेप्टेम्बर वट इज नेशनल साइंस डे नेशनल साइंस डे वन डू बी सेलिब्रेट ट्वेंटी एट फेब्रवरी नेशनल स्पोर्ट्स डे ट्वेंटी नाइन अगस्त दीज आर सम इम्पोर्टेंट डेज यू हैव टू रिमेंबर डी इज द राइट आंसर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच कंट्री विल होस्ट एशिया कप सो एशिया कप इज रिलेटेड टू क्रिकेट सो वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट एशिया कप ऑफ क्रिकेट टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू प्रीवियसली इट वॉज सपोज टू बी हैपन इन श्रीलंका नाउ इट हैज बीन रीशेड्यूल्ड नाउ इट विल हैपन इन यू ए यू ए द गल्फ कंट्री यू ए हुई द चीफ हुई द प्रेजिडेंट ऑफ बी सी सी आई द क्रिकेट इन कंडक्टिंग बॉडी ऑफ इंडिया बी सी सी आई बी सी सी आई बी सी सी आई बोर्ड चीफ इज सौरभ गांगुली सौरभ गांगुली ओके एंड हु इज आवर स्पोर्ट्स मिनिस्टर अनुराग ठाकुर अनुराग ठाकुर इज यूनियन मिनिस्टर फॉर स्पोर्ट्स नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन हु हैज बीन कन्फर्म विद द बेस्ट एक्टर अवार्ड फॉर द सिक्सटी एट्थ नेशनल फिल्म अवार्ड सो द टाइम द टाइम इज सिक्सटी एट्थ नेशनल फिल्म अवार्ड सो देर आर टू एक्टर्स वन इज ओवर इन द ऑप्शन अजय देवगन रिसीव दिस अवार्ड फॉर द मूवी तानाजी तानाजी ओके ही रिसीव द अवार्ड फॉर द मूवी तानाजी दानसंग वॉरियर तानाजी दानसंग वॉरियर एंड अनदर एक्टर इज देयर हु रिसीव दिस अवार्ड दैट इज सूर्या दैट इज सूर्या ओके सूर्या सोरो राय पोतरू द मूवी इज ही रिसीव द बेस्ट एक्टर अवार्ड सो देर आर टू एक्टर वन इज सूर्या एंड अनदर इज अजय देवगन सो द राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर डी राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर डी नेक्स्ट हु वन सिल्वर मेडल इन मैंस Javelin throw at World Athletics Championship 2022. Uh, students, the the competition is very high. Normally, the competition is very high in World Athletic Championship. I can say the uh, the competition more higher than the Olympics. Okay, so only one medal India received. Only one medal India uh, won. And we are talking about javelin throw. So we have a tiger of javelin that is Neeraj Chopra. That is Neeraj Chopra. Okay, and uh, and. Uh, He is the only. He is the second Indian only after Anju Bobby Jor. Anju Bobby Jor. Anju Bobby Jor uh, won the medal in two thousand three, and he uh, now the two thousand. We are in two thousand twenty two. This is the only second medal in World Athletics Championship. Silver medal. He won the silver medal. Okay. Next question. Jesse Daniel Award two thousand twenty one backed by whom? So who won the Jesse Daniel Award? Jesse Daniel Award won by K P Kumaran. K P Kumar and what is J C Daniel Award? J C Daniel Award is Kerala government's highest honor for lifetime contribute to Malayalam cinema. So it is a it is a award given in the contribution to Malayalam cinema cinema because uh, Malayalam is the official language of Kerala and Malayalam cinema if uh, any actor uh, uh, any actor contribute highest in uh, Malayalam cinema he will receive the J C Daniel Award. Okay, so the di direct question come. For which sector? For which cinema? For which state? JC Daniel Award uh, belongs. So, like as Kalinga Award belong to Odisha, in the similar way, JC Daniel Award belong to Kerala. Kerala CM is Penarai Vijayan. Arif Muhammad Khan is the Chief Minister. There are two. There are two important classical dance of Kerala. One is Kathakali, and one is Mohini Attam. Okay. These are some important facts about you have to remember. Next question. Has declared the global monkeypox outbreak a public health emergency of international concern. So now the COVID uh, almost had gone, but another uh, uh, emergency came. That is monkeypox. So who declared the monkeypox as a public health emergency? So uh, public health. What is public health emergency? Public health emergency is one step below the pandemic. One step below the pandemic. One step below. Like Corona was pandemic, one step below the pandemic is public health emergency concern. Okay, so who declared it? That is WHO, World Health Organization. World Health Organization. Okay, and uh, World Health Organization was founded on seventh April, nineteen forty-eight. That's why we we observe seventh April as World Health Day. Important day, World Health Day. Where is the headquarters of World Health Day? It is located in Geneva, the city of Switzerland. 
and what is the capital of switzerland switzerland capital is bern bern is the capital of switzerland and who is the current chief of uh, who it is t a z tedros adhanom ghebreyesus former foreign minister of ethiopia he was the former foreign minister of ethiopia and his tenure uh, previously he was appointed for 5 years now his tenure has uh, uh, renewed now next 5 year he will be the chief of who so tedros adhanom ghebreyesus is the chief of uh, who what about world bank world bank chief is david malpas david malpas who won the 109th tour de france 2022 title so first you have to know about the tour de france is a race about cycle 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 race okay now uh, who won the tour de france it is won jonas it is won by vinegard jonas vinegard and from which country jonas vinegard belong he is a dutch denmark he belong to denmark okay Co denmark capital is copenhagen and uh, okay so uh, jonas vinegar direct question this is the right answer who has re recently become the chief economist of world bank and he is the only second indian who became who ach who uh, achieved this post okay who has held this post he is the only second indian that is uh, first was koshik basu now it is indarmit gill so the question is important indarmit gill and and what was the earlier name what was the old name of oh, world bank it was ibrd 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 full form is international bank for reconstruction and development international bank for reconstruction and development okay this is ibrd and where is the headquarter of world bank it is in washington dc it is in washington dc okay so the right answer is indarmit gill next question who is the chief of world bank david molpos i have already told you in the previous question Kargil Vijay Divas is observed on 26 July for the victory India over Pakistan. So it is observed on 26 July 1999, 1999, and the an uh, an operation was successfully culminated at that that is Operation Vijay, Operation Vijay, the operation that was launched that was Operation Vijay. Okay, uh, and the uh, the battle was fought between 8 May 19, 8 May 1999 to. Uh, 26 July 1999. That's why that's why we observe 26 July as uh, Kargil Vijay Divas. So the question come in two to three ways. In Kargil Vijay Divas, which country defeated uh, Pakistan? That is India. Kargil Vijay Divas is observed on which day? That is 26 July. In which year it was? That is 1990. These are two to three types of question that can can come from this uh, particular topic. Sakhya Sagar, from which state has been included recently in Ramsar site? So the total tally of the Ramsar site now has been reached to fifty-four. Now India has fifty-four Ramsar site. India has fifty-four Ramsar Ramsar site. Now five new Ramsar site has been included. That are uh, one of them is Sakhya Sagar. Sakhya Sagar is uh, situated in which state? It is situated in Madhya Pradesh. It is situated in Madhya Pradesh. Now uh, Madhya Pradesh near the Madhav National Park. Madhav National Park. In Madhya Pradesh, as you know, Madhav National Park. So, Sakhya Sagar is uh, ne uh, nearer to Madhav National Park. Okay, and uh, uh, there are four other there are four other uh, Ramsar sites. That is uh, Mizoram Pala Lake. Okay, Mizoram Pala Lake, Ka Ka Karikili Bird Sanctuary, Karikili Bird Sanctuary of Tamil Nadu, Karikili Bird Sanctuary. Also included in the list. Now, the total tally you have to remember the total Ramsar site in India is. At present, total Ramsar sites are fifty-four. The number is fifty-four. Okay, the number is fifty-four. And as you know, Ramsar site, Ramsar site came into force. Ramsar Convention, actually not sites, it is convention. Ramsar Convention on Wetland came into force first Feb nineteen eighty-two. First Feb nineteen eighty-two. But the treaty was signed in nineteen seventy-one. And where is the place in Ramsar? Ramsar place is in Iran. It is an Iranian site. It is an Iranian place. Okay. So in 1971, in 1971, the convention was uh, uh, signed, and it came into force in first Feb 1982. Uh, 1982. Okay. That's why second Feb, second Feb every year, second Feb, we observe 
वेटलैंड डे इंटरनेशनल वेटलैंड डे इंटरनेशनल वेटलैंड डे सेकेंड फेब एवरी ईयर वी ऑब्जर्व इंटरनेशनल वेटलैंड डे ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन सो द करेक्ट आंसर इज मध्य प्रदेश साक्य सागर इज मध्य प्रदेश देर आर इंपोर्टेंट देर आर इंपोर्टेंट एट टू नाइन नेशनल पार्क इन मध्य प्रदेश वट आर दे दे आर काना नेशनल पार्क बांधवगढ़ नेशनल पार्क माधव नेशनल पार्क माधव नेशनल पार्क देर इज साख्य सागर इन नियर माधव नेशनल पार्क साख्य सागर संजय नेशनल पार्क संजय गांधी इट इज सम पार्ट ऑफ दिस नेशनल पार्क इज इन मध्य छत्तीसगढ़ ऑल्सो वन विहार नेशनल पार्क पन्ना सतपुरा पेंच मांडला ओके मांडला फोसिल फुल मांडला प्लांट फोसिल नेशनल पार्क दीज आर इंपोर्टेंट नाइन नेशनल पार्क फ्रॉम मध्य प्रदेश यू हैव टू नेम देर आर सम इंपोर्टेंट देर आर सम वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी इन मध्य प्रदेश वट आर दे लेट्स सी बोरी बोरी वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी दिस क्वेश्चन केम इन द आर एम सी एग्जाम दिसंबर जून टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू बोरी वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी केन घरियाल वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी नोरा देवी वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी इंपोर्टेंट एंड कूनो वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी नाउ इट हैज बिन कन्वर्टेड इन नेशनल पार्क कूनो नेशनल पार्क इज ऑल्सो देर एंड इन कूनो नेशनल पार्क अचीता विल केम फ्रॉम नामीबिया अचीता विल केम इंडिया विल इंडक्ट चीता फ्रॉम नामीबिया रिटर्न बैक नामीबिया चीता टू कूनो नेशनल पार्क रतापानी सेंचुरी एंड ओरछा सेंचुरी एंड ओरछा इज आ यूनेस्को हेरिटेज साइट्स ऑल्सो ओरछा ओके सो नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट ऑल वुमेन रन कोऑपरेटिव बैंक विल बी सेट अप इन विच स्टेट सो इट विल बी सेट अप इन राजस्थान द लार्जेस्ट स्टेट ऑफ इंडिया राजस्थ एंड वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट राजस्थान देर आर टू टू थ्री सिटी वन इज सन सिटी विच सिटी नोन एज सन सिटी एज ब्लू सिटी सन सिटी एंड ब्लू सिटी नोन एज जोधपुर एंड पिंक सिटी इज जयपुर ओके एंड देर इज अजमेर देर इज अजमेर डिस्ट्रिक्ट एवरी ईयर इन अजमेर पुष्कर कैमल फेयर इज ऑब्जर्व पुष्कर कैमल फेयर हैपन इन अजमेर एवरी ईयर एंड हु इज द गवर्नर ऑफ राजस्थान इट इज कलराज मिश्र अशोक गहलोत इज द चीफ मिनिस्टर कांग्रेस गवर्नमेंट इज देयर सी इज द राइट आंसर विच नेशन विल होस्ट टू जीरो टू फाइव वुमेन्स ओ डी आई वर्ल्ड कप सो इट विल बी होस्टेड बाय इंडिया इट विल बी होस्टेड बाय इंडिया ओके एंड फॉर इंडिया हैड प्रीवियसली होस्टेड द इवेंट इन नाइनटीन सेवेंटी एट इंडिया होस्टेड दिस इवेंट इन नाइनटीन सेवेंटी एट नाइनटीन नाइनटी सेवन एंड बट दिस फैक्ट्स आर नॉट इंपोर्टेंट सो द इंपोर्टेंट इज इंडिया विल होस्ट दिस टू टू जीरो टू फाइव वुमेन्स ओ डी आई वर्ल्ड कप इन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड वट अबाउट द मैंस वर्ल्ड It will be hosted by India in 2024. Okay, 2024. This is the right answer. Which country won the most gold medals at World Athletic Championship? So, uh, it it is uh, actually the event uh, was happened. The event World Athletic Champion was hosted by America. That's why America won the most gold medal. America won the most gold. And in which city the event was host, hosted? It was hosted in uh, Eugene. it was conducted in eugene eugene uh, is a city in oregon uh, states of america okay uh, so basically you have to remember the america usa because the name is very different uh, very few very few students know that about eugene where is eugene eugene is in america okay so most number uh, most gold medal won by america america won 13 gold 13 gold okay 9 silver 11 bronze and the what is the ranking of uh, india in world athletics champion India ranked at thirty third place, thirty third place, held with one silver medal won by javelin thrower Neeraj Chopra. Uh, every year, World Nature Conservation Day important question. World Nature Conservation Day. So we were observed in twenty eighth of July, twenty eighth of July. Okay, twenty eighth of July. And another important day is observed on twenty eighth of July. That is World Hepatitis Day. World Hepatitis Day. The same day that is twenty eighth of July. okay and the theme is bringing hepatitis theme is the theme is also important bringing hepatitis closer to you hepatitis care closer to you actually there are two question world nature conservation day is observed on 20th july similarly world hepatitis day is observed on 20th july and the theme of the year 2022 is bringing hepatitis care closer to you Is the richest woman of India in two zero two two? So it is Shiv Roshni Nadar Malhotra. Roshni Nadar Malhotra, the chairperson of SCL, SCL, and uh, and uh, one important school that is run by SCL company, that is uh, Vidya Gyan, Vidya Gyan School. Okay, Vidya Gyan School run by SCL company. So Roshni Nadar Malhotra is the richest woman. 
India's first indigenous aircraft carrier handed over to Indian Navy recently. So, what is the name? It is INS Indian Naval Ship Vikrant. INS Vikrant. Okay. Previously, uh, uh, INS Vikrant played a vital role in uh, 1971 war with Bangladesh. But at that time, it was not, not indigenously made. It was not indigen indigenously made. Now it is in completely in made by India. Okay, it is completely made by India. That's why INS Vikrant is handed over to Indian Navy. Uh, R. Hari Kumar. R. Hari Kumar is the chief. V. R. Chaudhary is the Air Force chief. And Manoj Pandey is the Army chief. These are three important chiefs you have to remember. Uh, G. Ashok Kumar, first maritime coordinator. G. Ashok Kumar. You cannot uh, forget this name. G. Ashok Kumar, first maritime coordinator. 29th July is observed at the International Tiger Day. International Tiger Day. International Tiger Day. Okay. Uh, and that uh, Project Tiger was launched in Project Tiger was launched in uh, uh, 1973 in the Indira Gandhi government. So Project Tiger was launched in 1970. And there is an authority. There is a uh, legal authority in India that is NTCA, National Tiger Conservation Authority, that was established in 2005. Uh, if you want to uh, do your preparation through hostel, uh, both boys and girls, they can visit our hostel, uh, take proper information. These are official numbers, just dial this number and take proper information. How can you join our hostel? Hostel provide you the most practice. If you want a practice, uh, if, you, if you want a very high practice, just join our hostel. Recently, a teaching robot named as Eagle has been introduced in the school of this city. So, the name of the teaching uh, robot Eagle, it has been introduced in Hyderabad, the capital city of Telangana. And it, this robot is fluent in 30 languages, 30 languages, okay. This uh, robot is fluent in 30 languages. And uh, Hyderabad is located on the river of Musi, Musi, okay. Uh, Hyderabad, the twin city is Sikandrabad, the city of Telangana. Telangana, I am talking about Telangana, KCR is the chief minister and Tamil Sai Sondarajan is the governor of Hyderabad. Hyderabad is an important festival that is Batukamma festival and Bonalu festival. Batukamma and Bonalu. Uh, every year, World Day Against Trafficking in Person is observed on, it is observed on uh, the 30th of July. It is observed on direct question 30th of July. Joint military exercise Al Naja 4th. This is the fourth version. Is uh, between India and India and Oman. India and Oman. And it will be conducted between in uh, in Rajasthan uh, between Raj in Rajasthan between one to thirteen August one to thirteen August, okay. And uh, Oman capital is Muscat, Yemen capital is uh, uh, what is the capital of Yemen? Jordan Amman capital, okay. Jordan Amman, and uh, I forgot the name. I am I'm, right now. I am not getting the name of Yemen capital. Okay, here. Uh, Mm. Next, let's move to the next question. Who clinched India's first gold medal of Commonwealth Games 2022? So the Commonwealth Games is going on. Uh, first, first gold medal is clinched by Mirabai Chanu. Mirabai Chanu, the weightlifter Mirabai Chanu, 49th kg weightlifter Mirabai Chanu, clinched the first gold medal. And 2022 Commonwealth Games is happening in Birmingham, the city of England. What about 20, 2026? It will be hosted by Victoria City of Australia. Victoria. Victoria. The name is Victoria 2026. Victoria City of Australia. So Australia country will host. The, the famous place is Victoria. Like as Birmingham is in England. In the same way, Victoria will, will host 2026 Commonwealth Games. In India. How many times India hosted the uh, Commonwealth Games? Only one time. Only one time. In That is in 2010. 2010. Commonwealth Games. Name the first state in India to launch semiconductor policy from 2022 to 27. It is Gujarat. It is Gujarat. And who is the chief minister? Bhupendra Bhai Patel is the chief minister. And who is the governor? Acharya Devrat. Acharya Devrat. And Gujarat is the same state who shares the longest, who shares the longest coastal line. Who shares the longest coastal line. Okay. And there is an important national park. Green National Park is located in Gujarat. Which of the following is the government owned telecom company? So it is BSNL, Bharat Sanchar Nigam Limited. And where is the headquarters of BSNL? It is located in New Delhi. New Delhi. 
न्यू डेली एंड हुई द चेयरमैन परवीन कुमार परवार पी के पी परवीन कुमार परवार इज द चेयरमैन एंड एम डी ऑफ बी एस एन एल एंड हुई इज अवर टेलीकॉम मिनिस्टर हुई अवर टेलीकॉम मिनिस्टर दिस इज इंपॉर्टेंट मोर इंपॉर्टेंट इनफैक्ट टेलीकॉम मिनिस्टर इज अश्वनी वैष्णव अश्वनी वैष्णव इज द अवर टेलीकॉम मिनिस्टर मोर इंपॉर्टेंट देन दिस क्वेश्चन अश्वनी वैष्णव इज टेलीकॉम मिनिस्टर बिकॉज इट हैज बीन नोटिस इन द प्रीवियस एग्जाम्स इन आर एम सी यू पी सैनिक सैनिक दे आर आस्किंग अबाउट यूनियन मिनिस्टर्स ओके दे आर आस्किंग अबाउट यूनियन मिनिस्टर सो दैट वाई द क्वेश्चन इज इंपॉर्टेंट Recently, government has launched which campaign about flag hosting? So the campaign is Har Gar Tiranga. That is Har Gar Tiranga. And government of India, uh, government of India uh, actually uh, changed, amend, actually amend our flag code. The flag code you have to remember this fact. Flag code was started in the year two zero two 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 zero two. Government changed this flag code. Change uh, actually it, it is not change. Amend. government amended this uh, some rules in from the flag code what are they uh, now the flag can be hosted from 13th to 15th august day and night day and night and previously the public authority was eligible to host the flag now every indian every indian can host the flag from 13 august to 15 august because azadi ka amrit mahotsav is near to commemorate the 75 years of azadi amrit mahotsav okay so uh, uh, you can uh, people can display the uh, flag 24 into 7 24 is so you have to remember two to three thing that is flag code was came in 2002 you can host the flag 24 into 7 and the time will be 13 august to 15 august and you can uh, host the you can display the flag at your homes roof at your home anywhere you want who won french grand prix 2022 so french grand prix was won by max verstappen max verstappen okay and he is a belgian formula 1 racer belgian formula 1 racer and sebastian vettel has announced his retirement and german driver uh, sebastian vettel louis hamilton from england okay see the right answer no 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 it, it is not c it is option by it is option by just i this answer option by okay next question uh, today last question or burning question what is the burning question as you know i provide you a very important question in the form of burning say kasina is the current pm prime minister of which country and it is our neighbor country all this option are our neighbor country so you have to tell uh, say kasina is the current prime minister of which country okay this is a burning question let's see how many of you answer this question in the comment box maximum students should answer this question if you do so you will keep this question will be kept in your memory and you can mark this question in the exam directly okay uh, this is our primary uh, pramveer course we had launched in 15 july just join it because the sheets uh, still the course is not um, uh, covered too much and these are our recorded course these are our pen drive courses you can avail if you like the like it share it don't forget to hit the bell icon subscribe the channel if you do so because we provide two to three series like a sankalp series the most famous series aga series for navodaya series current affair series and so many other important information regarding form regarding form you should know so uh, there is a reason to subscribe and hit the bell icon of our channel uh, if you have any information you can ask from this number these are our official number so student all the best thanks for watching